guys let's look at this problem right here this question is asking an electron is initially at rest in an electric field it is accelerated by that field and experience a potential difference of 2.54 milli megavolts calculate the final speed of the electron in meter per second here this electron is initially at rest in an electric field it means this is a potential energy in electric field okay and potential energy equation in electric field is given by this one Q times V, capital V. Capital V is voltage, Q is the charge of the electron. And when it started to move, what's going to happen is we, it's going to turn into kinetic energy, but the speed is really high. Like when we have speed more than 10% of the light, we have to use relativistic kinetic energy equation. If you use the other equation, you are going to have the speed higher than the speed of light. It's not possible, right? So here we are going to use the relativistic kinetic energy equation that is given by gamma minus 1 mc square, okay? Now we know that gamma is equivalent to 1 over square root of 1 minus v square over c square. Here the question is asking us to find out the speed. The speed is this v. This v is what we are trying to find. This v, okay? Now let's go ahead and write other things. Here we have mc square, but if I bring this one, this minus one, and if I bring this mc square to this side, this is going to be qv divided by mc square, and uh, let's go ahead and plug the values. So 1 over square root of 1 minus v square over c square, minus 1 is equal to qv. Here our charge is negative 1.602 times 10 to the power of minus 19. This negative represents the direction. Here the question is asking us to find out the speed, right? Speed doesn't have direction. If it's velocity, we can bring that one, but since the question is speed, we don't have to bring the negative sign. We can just put the 1.602, 1.602 times 10 to the power of minus 19, and uh, times the voltage, that is megavolt, 2.54 megavolts. 2.54 mega is 10 to the power of 6, and that one divided by the mass of the electron that's given by 9.11 times 10 to the power of minus 31 times the speed of light square. Speed of light is 3 times 10 to the power of 8. And if you square that one, that's going to give you 9 times 10 to the power of 16. Okay. Now we have all the values. And if you simplify this value, you are going to get 4.8. 96835 okay so this is the value for this part now let's go ahead and find rearrange this equation first we have 1 over square root of 1 minus v square over c square and if i bring this negative one to this side this is going to be 4.96835 plus 1 and that's going to give us 5.96835 and if we rearrange this equation that's going to become 1 minus v square over c square is going to be equivalent to 1 over 5.96835 and this value you will get and let's also square this one like to get rid of the square root we can square both sides so if you get rid of the square root you have to square other side so this side we are going to square and if you square, you're going to get 0 0.02807. Okay, our question is we, so we have to rearrange this one furthermore. Like, let's bring this one to this side. So this is going to become 1 minus 0 0.02807. 0 .02807. That's equivalent to this one v square over c square okay v square over c square now this one is going to give us 0 0.97193 and we multiply this one with c square c square c square is 9 times 10 to the power of 16 that's going to be equal to v square so if we want to find v we have to multiply and square both sides if you multiply and square you are going to get 2. 2.958 times 10 to the power of 8 meter per second okay in uh, three decimal places this is going to be the answer okay this is our final answer 
meter per second so this would be per second meter per second and that's our final answer i hope this helps thanks for watching